Yo, what's good guys? It is JD here. Hello and welcome to today's No Money Spent episode and the first one of season number seven and the day in which we have opened up the most packs this year by far. Ladies and gentlemen, I opened up three million MTs worth of packs today, which equates to 190 packs. We are talking Troy Dan numbers of packs. Um, and uh, it, it wasn't great, but we had Kobe, we had Giannis, we had Kobe, we had Giannis. Also Invincible Penny Hardaway, so three Invincibles, two Heroes, three other Dark Matters. We did end up pulling a few Dark Matters, and we did end up pulling one decent card. And all those pack pulls will be in today's video, so you can see the highs, uh, but mainly the lows of what we pulled. But yeah, 3 million MT spent, which is pretty ropey. Uh, we are under 9 million MT now, don't worry about that. Uh, I've got bids on quite a few cards because there is a lot of maxed out cards. There's a lot of 80 Hoffbad Giannis's uh, and Kobe's out there and Penny Hardaway's out there. A lot of them out there. So I'm keeping my eyes on things and maybe we'll make a big move on one of those at some point. We'll wait and see. Of course, new season. There's a lot for us to talk through. I'm going to talk you through everything that is new today, what I think's worth it, what I think's not worth it. And we've also got our showdown XP to cash in. So we are going to zoom, zoom all the way up to level uh, 23. 30, imagine. 23, so we're going to have plenty of essential balls to go through as well. So, plenty to go through. Let's jump into it at the start of season number seven. If you open up packs today, how did you get on? I'm sure you did. When you see Kobe and Giannis on a pack, you open up a pack. How many did you open up? Did you pull Kobe? Did you pull Giannis? Yes or no? Let me know down below. But there we go. Let's jump into it. If you're new to the channel, subscribe to the daily videos and check out facebook.com slash crossover for the daily streams. There's an easy locker code to get a token right there. And uh, then as we come to, let's just knock out the playoff agendas here because it's super easy. Uh, Marcus Smart, 24 and 12 for a slasher badge pack. And then Grant Williams, 19 points in a steal for five tokens. Super easy. Right, XP. So in terms of the levels, you've got a Stacey Augman, who's not very good. A Ronald Murray, who's half decent. A uh, Leon Powell, who's not good. A uh, Donya Marshall, who's okay. And an Austin Carr, who's okay. And then level four, what the hell? And uh, then level 33, Mike Conley. We don't care about Mike Conley, he's six foot one. Uh, level 40, it is Invincible Anthony Edwards. He looks good, he looks solid. Uh, we are going to get him. I'm not going to go for first. Nobody cares about Anthony Edwards today. When you've got Kobe and Pax, ain't nobody caring about Invincible Anthony Edwards. When you've got Scotty Pippen on the block, nobody cares about this card. So, yeah, he's there. We will get him in our own time. So, how long would that take? Let's find out. So, um, Hero Zion, who, by the way, um, you can make any old meme about what this card looks like. But um, for me, it's the meme of, like, the muscle dog. Uh, that's the one that comes to mind. Um, yep, yeah, Zion looking like I don't even know what. But anyway, he's there. 3,500 XP for him. Super easy. Weekend Warriors here for a fan favourites pack. Outdated, but still got a good card in it, I guess, in KD. Uh, Fearless XP is an absolute joke. Original owner, Hero Yarnis. Kobe, Hero Yarnis, yeah. Original owner, Kobe Hero. Uh, and original owner, Invincible Penny, Yarnis and Kobe. Like, are you kidding me? You want us to pull three Invincibles and both heroes? That would cost... I, 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 don't, even, I don't even think it would be possible. I mean, maybe it would be, but I think there would be a case that you could say that would be physically impossible uh, to do, is what it is. Uh, season 6 or Season 7 XP tip-off for one zero Gravity Deluxe Pack. It's kind of dead, but it is what it is. Uh, the Mighty Draft, they're still trying to get people to play the draft again because nobody really plays that. Token awards for some big boy XP. You've got um, 14,000 in there, which is obviously quite nice. And the Season 7 rewards and Spotlight for 20 tokens. I mean, it's solid enough. You get some nice enough XP. And then the Season 6 Unlimited Showdown Award, which, of course, we have got. So let's go ahead and cash this bad boy, and hopefully it works. I've given 2k a few hours uh, in case it didn't. There is our Season 7 15,000 XP. We get it out of the pack, and hopefully it should be working. But I haven't done this since Season 3. We've already done this once before. So for the second time, 15,000 XP... It should be quite exciting when it comes out of the pack, but it's not. And there we go, level 23. This might take a while. Let's go. So, 25 tokens. Lovely. One token. Not so lovely. Slash a badge pack. Cool. Don't know rings pack. Yeah. Stacey Augman. Three tokens. Glass cleaner. See some ball. Post scorer. So, it's stacking the ascensions here. Because it hasn't given us any so far. So, it's, it's put all of our picks together, hopefully. You know, pal. Sharpshoot badge pack. Don't know rings pack. And then the essential ball. We should have quite a few picks here. My mic's in the way. 14 picks. Ooh. 14 picks for Joe Dumas. Now, Joe Dumas himself, 6'3 point guard, you know, here it is, what it is. We've got plenty of those 
in the rewards this season. Can you let me off the first board, please? What are we doing? Get me out of here. Please. I mean, at least they're all plus ones, but golly. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, great start to the season. Thanks, 2K. Brilliant. Fantastic. Right, we're going up with 12 picks to go. But, yeah, Joe Dumas, he's there. I don't particularly care for him. If we get him, we get him. If we don't, I'm definitely not going to lose uh, any sleep over it. I kind of don't want to get him already, though. I feel like I'd be a bit anticlimactic. Like, we're going to just start the season. I don't really want to get him on the first day. But, I mean, shit, if we get him, we get him. I know a lot of people have managed to get him on the very first board. Uh, and we are talking like the first board as in like when you have one pick or like two picks or whatever it is. People have got them on the level five ascension. But anyway, we're going up to the top with 10 picks to go here. He could be coming through here, you know, 10 picks, ascension. Last season, we did get the ascension prize, which was Jerry Sloan. I think we got him quite early. I think we got him on level 22. And we are on level 22 uh, ascension board right now. So, all right. You know what? If we get it, we get it. Here we go. 10 picks for the Ascension Grand Prize. Two extra picks. Okay. I don't think that I'm going to be that excited if we get it. We get a triple. Oh, baby, a triple. Give me the Grand Prize and I'll take three. No. 400 MT into 1,200 when there's just 1,000 MT spots out here anyway. But, I mean, hey, it is what it is. Um, we'll keep going. Eight picks to go. I said I won't even be mad if you don't give me it. I would like something, though. Like, you know, are there any packs out here? Thank you. Fan favorites pack. Are there any more packs out here? I kind of, kind of want more of those fan favorite packs that you just had there for me, 2K. There's a thousand MT, which I would have liked earlier. And you got to think, like, we just got a fan favorites pack from just this, just one pick on this, or you can do the entirety of Weekend Warrior, the grand prize. We've done it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Dark Matter, Joe Dumas, the grand prize comes through on the first Ascension trip of the season. This isn't the first board because this is a combination of like a few boards. Uh, but the first trip to the top and we've got the grand prize already. Day one is done. Um, okay, there we go. So we've got 26, 30 and 35 to go and, and we don't need to, uh, don't need to worry about that anytime soon. Right, let's open up these badge packs now. Off badges, I wouldn't mind. We are lacking a few. We've got 67, I believe. And we did today manage to get um, two Hoff badges out of badge packs. We got our third Interceptor, which sucks. And then we also got Acrobat, which was our second Acrobat. So that was a duplicate as well. So we haven't got any new Hoff badges. We just got duplicates. But let's hope out of all of these. these are quite, there's quite a few of them here. I think there's like six here in total. Just, just one? Just, just one? Okay, 0 for 3, not ideal. We're literally just discarding everything that's coming out of these. Um, we've got, oh, we still got another three left. Come on, 2K. Just one, the one time. I need tight handles, needle threader, um, something else, something else. Uh, pro touch, we need that. Another two to open up still. Okay, let's go. We'll open up all those donut rating packs later. We're not going to open up those on video because, you know, I nobody care about that. Oh dear, okay, nothing again. I think we're down to our final um, final shot at a Hoff badge. We are all oh, fan favorites pack. All right, go on in. Well, on the one time, give me a KD. I'll, I'll take a KD as payment. Oh my days, you give me a double shake. And it's a diamond and a pink diamond. Oh, that sucks. Why do diamonds even shake anymore? That shouldn't be a thing. Ah, uh, we get Diamond DeRozan Dynamic Ratings, which means it is a pink diamond from the fan favourite set. Um, Caruso? Caruso? Ah, oh, I called it. Nice. Um, it's not nice. Ah, oh, dear, oh dear. Okay, we move on. We move on. All right, now you need to give me a Hoff badge to make up for that 2K. They're going to be two shakes, and it wasn't anything that I actually wanted. The big sad. Okay, let's go back. And let's do it. I'll open up all those other cards and players tomorrow. I still do need to do the weekly challenge for the free pack, which we'll get through at some point over the weekend. And we end all of those packs with no Hoff badges. You don't like it. You don't like it. All right, let's talk about the new game mode. So triple thread offline um, is, is really, really pathetic. 50 wins for 6,000 tokens. So oh, imagine 6,000 MT and 45 tokens, less than one token per game. Uh, and then 6,500 MT, like, be less creative with these. Uh, Bob Lanier is okay, 610 centre. LaMarcus Aldridge is distinctly average. So in the vault, not great. And the rest of the vault is obviously pretty bad. Um, 
Triple Threat Offline needs a whole revamp. So pretty, pretty poor from Triple Threat Offline standpoint. Domination. Now, there's good and there's bad. So the good. Every conference you finish, no, every division you finish, you get a Hall of Fame badge option pack. So a whole finishing option, post scoring option, rebounding option pack, shot creating option pack, playmaking option pack, and a sharp shooting option pack. You get the diamond consumables at 33, which is a couple of diamond contracts and shoe boots and shoes, 100 tokens at 66 six stars. Add that to the 15 tokens you get per division. Uh, you are looking at, uh, what is that, 15, 30, 45, 90? Quick maths? Oh, I hope so. You're looking at about like 190 tokens, and then for each game on its entire, on itself, you get a contract pack and badge pack, which is useless, and 1,000 MT, so you get 30,000 MT for it. So 30,000 MT, 200 tokens, five off badges, which is nice, um, and then a Galaxy Open, an Invincible six-foot point guard, which is not nice, but it's five-minute quarters, and I cannot believe they didn't change it. Half an hour per game of offline in 2022 is just awful. That's such a bad game design. Four-minute quarters would have been okay. Three-minute quarters would have been uh, amazing. Five-minute quarters, 16-hour grind for this. And it's, just, it's it's not so much the time. It's just how mind-numbingly boring it is. So I really do think they've dropped the ball with that. That should have been less. Pretty disappointed in that. But the Hoff badges uh, are at least nice. For the challenges over here, just a one challenge, fearless challenge um, for that pack. Scored 25 points as a team, job done. Uh, pickup challenge is sad. Um, still just dynamic ratings, league packs are pretty trash. Uh, the spotlights are back for another shot of the Hoff badge and then another 100 tokens. So that's the same as it has been. And then just one signature challenge this season. That's it. So 30 minutes of content over six weeks is kind of tough, uh, but it is for a Hoff badge again. So of course we will be doing that in the not too distant future. Online, clutch time, mad. Fernando Martin looking like one of the best reward cards that we have got today. So, yes, definitely pick up Fernando Martin and go for clutch time. In the draft, it is... Moses Malone? No, he's over here, isn't he? No, that's Bob Lanier. Yeah, Bob Lanier. Okay, so it's Moses Malone in the draft, 6'10 centre, so, you know, is what it is. If you like him, you like him. Uh, Triple that online looking pretty damn um, lacklustre. Uh, uh, Jamal Wilkes in there, who looks good. Uh, but not really that exciting. Michael Finley in Unlimited does look really good. Again, one of the better cards we've got today. So Michael Finley is looking nice. We will be going for him in Unlimited. And then obviously in Limited, we don't know yet. It's going to be a vote again. Uh, and in Limited specifically this weekend, Fearless Packs, Diamond Contracts, and Diamond Shoes, and uh, Tokens. And you've got to use one team, which I really like. One team, one Opal, Pink Diamond, Diamond, Amethyst, and Ruby. I like it. I like it a lot. Right, over here, Galaxy Opals. Both of these, pretty awful. Why have 1,700 people taken Hassan Whiteside? The XP, I guess. Bad. Not good. Uh, Dark Matters. You've got Anton Jameson and Big O. Big O, I would say, is probably the better of the two, but realistically, just take whatever position you need. 2,200 people taking Big O and 1,600 people taking Anton Jameson. In the token market, it is sadly as bad as it has ever been. They've given us three-month-old um, All-Star packs for two weeks because they think that's fun. Uh, but there was a Hoff badge in here earlier. I've already taken mine. I've got a duplicate handles for days. I would definitely recommend you take that. It was 75 tokens for a random. It's my third handles for days, which just sucks. But, you know, that's typical of how we've been lately. Uh, but, yeah, it's worth it. At least they put something in the token market. It was a one-time random Hoff badge, 75 tokens. Um, but, yeah, the fact that they put this pack in here just shows they are still completely out of touch, which is a shame. But, yeah, Big O and Anton are good cards in their own regard. And then we have packs. And then we have packs. 3% chance at a Dark Matter. Don't know about that one, Chief. Um, Kobe, Giannis, Baron Davis, Jalen Green, Pen Pen, Kobe, Joe Johnson, and Giannis. I opened up, th it's not a joke, boys, 3 million MTs worth of packs. 190 packs. <sighs> this is how it went. I mean, I'll take it. I'll, I'll, I'll obviously buy that. It's not bad. That's not bad. No shaking 300k, bro. The shakes have been so bad here. We haven't even pulled an opal yet. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. My birthday, my birthday. Come on, Kobe, 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 Kobe. Or Giannis. Oh, we got a voice. Come on, come on, come on. I don't want to look. I don't want to look. I do want to look. I don't want to look. I'm going to riff it. I'm not going to look. Please. Shooting guard. Lakers. 24. Who's that? Oh. Yeah, why the way that you are? 
And it was Drew Johnson! I'm kind of glad I didn't look because I would have saw a shooting guard and got really excited and I would have got really sad. <laughs> oh no, it was a shooting guard. Hey, bro, there's barely any of them up, you know. Hey, they're opening up. All right, get your ass out of here. Get me some MT back. See you later. No! All right, thankfully, Norman Powell doesn't shake out of that one. Tell me it's not five and a quarters. Yes! Middle! Middle, 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 Got another one! I've got another one. I've got another one. i just turn my mic on. Please, please. please. <laughs> no shot! <laughs> no! Kidding me? Western Conference shooting guard. Why? There's just no need, 2K. There's absolutely no need. All right, we are coming down to under 15 mil. That means we have gone through one third of our pack opening so far. Oh no, no, it's probably just going to be fearless set again. We've got another chance. Oh, we've got another chance. Come on, please. Please! You've shown me shooting... No, what did we get? We got... Oh, I can't remember what we got. What did we get? We got shooting guard east. We got shooting guard west. Come on. Come on. It's my birthday. Please. 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 Less than point guard. Ugh. God. Fucking damn it, bro. You've got to be kidding me. I pulled all three Dark Matters from the Fearless set. We've opened up half an hour's worth of packs. There we go. Okay, we didn't have to go too far. We didn't have to go too far. We didn't have to go too far. I said I was going to stop at 14 mil. I didn't. I said we're going to go to our next Dark Matter. We got one. We have already pulled Jalen Green. Iso Joe and Baron Davis. Tico, please. It's my birthday. Come on. It's my birthday week. <sighs> Kovio Yon is my birthday. Please. I can't. I don't want to look. I don't even want to look because I'll probably think of the wrong conference or something. <sighs> I've just spent 2 million MT, 2K. I've spent 2 million MT. And that is why I didn't look. <sighs> Western shooting guard. Again. <sighs> Western shooting guard. Again. He's still 100k. I'm just going to take another 100k for him. Absolutely horrific. Absolutely embarrassing. Don't open packs. Don't spend your money on this. Don't do it. You do the same thing if I was in my position. I mean, it's invincible Giannis. It's invincible Kobe. Like, a drop like this ain't going to happen every day. <laughs> Thankfully. Jesus Christ. Otherwise, we would be broke very quickly. Uh, a drop like this don't happen every day. Yeah. Come on, there's six. There's six. Come on, 2K. I've been such an idiot. Dude, this has taken three million MT to get six. Three million MT. Please don't troll me. Please don't screw me again. I swear to God, please. Just Kobe or Giannis or Penny. Please. Please. Yes. No, yes, yes, yes. Yes! Hero Yannis! There we go! Three million MT later! Why are you in a 76ers jersey? I don't understand. We get the Greek God Yannis! Three mil boys! You all told me to stop, and I should have stopped. That is one expensive ass card right there. Oh my god, it's not the Invincible, but it is an original owner. Greek God Hero Yannis.
<laughs> that cost me three million MT. Ah, let's go about damn time. One more for luck, see if we go back to back. But I am stopping now. Oh my god, we did so many packs. Oh, that was so awfully badly so bad. Oh my days. And we're on next gen, next gen packs OP, clearly. No, they're definitely not. Oh my god. And the first one's only 600k. Oh, what do we do? Do we badge him? Do we not? What, what do we do? I right, send me back to current gen real quick. Yeah, get me back to my hometown. All right, so there you have it. My goodness gracious me. We managed to pull all three of the fearless dark matters. Uh, we sold two Jalen Greens for 100k. We sold uh, Baron Davis for 100k. Uh, yeah, that's right. One, two, uh, three. And then we pulled two Joe Johnsons who we have since sold and we've got cash in now. But then, thankfully, we did pull a Giannis. Don't worry about Kobe. We'll talk about him in a second. We did pull a Giannis. It took me three million MT. But we got there. Um, don't worry about all the outbids. But here we go. So 110k for a Joe Johnson. Diamond contract sold. Good times. 110k for a Joe Johnson. 84k for a Joe Johnson. 560k for our hero Giannis. Thank God for that. We at least made back some, not a lot, but some MT today because uh, today has been a very, very tough day um, to manage. I forgot to mention about the exchange, by the way. Uh, Zach Levine's a joke. Absolutely awful card. Normal jump shot. Don't take him. AC Green. I mean, it's cool that they're integrating stamina cards here, but realistically, he's just not very good. I think Sam Cassell's another six foot three point guard. Like, we need another one of those. Um, if you're a T Wolves fan, ball out, go for him. Uh, it's not expensive, but that's because the card's not too great either. So, he changes there. Nothing uh, nothing too crazy. As for the cards that came out today, well, this is where the, the best stuff happened. Which is sad to say that the best stuff was just the cards in packs, but kind of was the uh, kind of is the case. Normal Pal, looking very nice. Chris Boucher, a little bit undersized. Isaac Coro, really good. Bruce Bowen, 3 and D, OP. Mike Miller, a little bit of everything. Danny Ferry doing Danny Ferry type things. Very, very strong. Iso Joe is top tier for his price as well. Fantastic card. Really, really good. Jalen Green has zero defensive Hoff badges, which is a pain. But it's Jalen Green. He's pretty damn cool. And then Baron Davis. Yet another six foot three point guard. So again, if that's your vibe, then ball out and go for him. Uh, and then, of course, we had the uh, the actual cards that we wanted to pull that we didn't pull today. So sad. Penny Hardaway comes in at 1 million MT. Why is that 100k? Why are you, why are you down here, Penny? How did you get to the final 30 seconds? So low. There we go. Um, but anyway, Penny Hardaway is here. Now, his jump shot is not the best, which is why he's a little bit low already. But it's Penny Hardaway, 6 foot 7, 65 off badges, baller card. Invincible Kobe Bryant. Oh, only 1.5 mil. Damn, that's crashing. Bro, he's been two, he's been two mil solid for the first four, four hours or so. Anyway, uh, it's Kobe Bryant. He's a joke. Ridiculous. Uh, very quick release, quick jump shot. Um, he's not got a scope in behind the back or James Harden behind the back. Um, and then obviously 99 stats everywhere, 65 off badges. Really, really good uh, card. And then we've got Giannis, who is coming in. At two and a half million MT flat. Ah, this is not a drill. Um, and he is just a joke, isn't he? Absolute joke. Um, again, 99 stats everywhere, 65 Hall of Fame badges. Brilliant. Now, we come down to the Age of Heroes set, or Return of Heroes set, shall I say. And... These cards are not the same. These cards are very, very strange. Ain't no way. Oh, I hate how laggy this game is, bro. Damn it. Um, yeah, these cards are not the same. Now, you would expect these cards to be better than their counterparts. Or the same, but they're considerably worse. This Giannis has got 33 Hoff badges, and obviously not 99 stats, only an 84 3 ball. Um, but it's got 33 Hoff badges, the Invincible's got 65. So you are going to have to lock in this set with a worse version of a Giannis, which you could buy from the auction house already. Which doesn't really make sense to me. Uh, but this Giannis is still a joke. This Giannis is still crazy good. And then, oh, hello, Kobe, in your fat suit. How you doing? Uh, by the way, this is laughable. This looks like it was done by a child. What is that? Why Why is that there, then? Um, anyway, this Kobe is absolutely incredible. For a Dark Matter Kobe, there's not that much difference between this one and the Invincible, I want to say. Um, defensive badges are, are missing, but it's still got a you know, 33 half badge on a Dark Matter Kobe. And I managed to scoop that bad boy for 275,000 MT. I don't think that's bad. Less than 300k for a Dark Matter Kobe? Hmm, tell me that's bad. I don't think it is. And to be honest, you can maybe get him for about 
450k ish and these are the hollow cards by the way yeah that's that's a hollow card right there uh, and just to show you guys a side by side of a hollow kobe and the kobe that i've got again i don't like them it's just literally made them black and white though there's no there's no hollow about it it's literally just black and white there's nothing hollow there so yeah not really vibing with that uh, with that kobe all that much let me show you this real quick <laughs> there's a lot going on here so 48 Giannis, which maybe we'll go for. Um, this one's 48 as well. 80 Hoff Badge Kobe, 47 Giannis, 80 Hoff Badge Hollow Kobe, and then 52 Hoff uh, Giannis there. Uh, 80 Hoff Giannis, but then look at the state of this. 78, 80, 80, 80, 80, all within 20 minutes of each other, or 30 minutes of each other. 30 minutes with five maxed out Giannis is selling. I think one of those might slip through, and then there's two 78. Hero Giannis is selling within 25 minutes of each other. So, there's a lot going down right here. Um, I'm going to try and scoop up a, a really fancy Giannis because it would be pretty ridiculous to play one for a while. We will be going into clutch time uh, this season, of course, and we've got to play limited as well. But I want to make sure we've got some very nice players going in to the following, uh, into the following game. So, we're down 8.8 mil. Don't worry. We've got so much MT we can cash in here. Um... Wait, what did I get out bid 700k on? Oh, Penny Hardaway, yeah. I just spent 700k on Penny Hardaway. <laughs> and that Giannis as well. Give me that back. There we go. So back at 10 mil. There we go. We're back at 10 mil already. It's fine. We've got those MT. We did lose out about 2.3 today. But hey, it was Giannis. It was Kobe. We had to try. We didn't get a single invincible out of 3 million MTs with packs. So yeah, don't open packs. But that is going to do it for the start of season number 7. Oh my god. Hopefully it's going to be a good season for us. Hopefully one day we can get good pack luck. But it ain't today. That uh, is going to do it for me today, everybody. I hope you have enjoyed. As usual, please like subscribe. I'll see you next time. And peace.